India's quest to modernize its air force isn't new. Decades of reliance on foreign aircraft, like the MiG-21 and Mirage 2000, forced the Indian Air Force to face challenges in logistics, spare parts, and combat readiness. The need for an indigenous solution became clear, and thus the HAL Tejas was born, a versatile, homegrown jet aimed at reducing dependence on foreign equipment. Development of the Tejas began in the early 1980s under India's Light Combat Aircraft LCA program. Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, HAL, spearheaded the initiative to build a multi-role fighter capable of air superiority, ground attack, and reconnaissance missions. With decades of trial, testing, and redesigns, HAL created a single-engine, multi-role jet that could carry advanced weaponry and tackle threats in the air or on the ground. Let's look at the numbers. The HAL Tejas weighs around 13.5 tons when fully loaded, has a length of 13.2 meters, and a wingspan of 8.2 meters. Powered by the GEF-404 engine, it can reach a top speed of Mach 1.6 and boasts a combat range of 500 kilometers, with a ferry range of 3,200 kilometers. It's equipped with advanced avionics, air-to-air -air missiles, precision-guided bombs, and beyond visual range, BVR capabilities. Its radar cross-section is minimized thanks to composite materials, enhancing its stealth. Now, why is the Tejas so significant? First, it's lightweight and nimble, giving it agility in dogfights. Second, it's designed with advanced avionic systems that provide pilots with improved situational awareness. Furthermore, Tejas' relatively low operational costs make it a cost-effective solution for the Indian Air Force, allowing for high sortie rates during combat. What's unique about the Tejas? Unlike many of its contemporaries, it has a high percentage of indigenous content, around 60%, with India aiming for an even higher proportion in the coming years. This not only helps in boosting the domestic defense industry, but also allows India more strategic independence in wartime. India's positioning in Asia makes it critical to have an agile and versatile air force. The Tejas plays a key role in modernizing India's capabilities, especially in the context of rising tensions with neighbors like China and Pakistan. Tejas is expected to perform air superiority missions, ground attack roles, and even maritime strike capabilities. In recent exercises, the Tejas has demonstrated its ability to integrate with other platforms and perform in multi-role scenarios, making it a valuable asset in India's defense arsenal. India is not alone in upgrading its air force. Countries like China and Pakistan have their own programs with jets like the JF-17 Thunder and J-10. But Tejas stands apart with its advanced radar systems, agility, and cutting-edge avionics. If India can continue scaling its Tejas production and enhance its export potential, this aircraft has the capability to alter the regional balance of power. As of now, it is unknown how many Tejas jets have been made for the Indian Air Force, with orders of over 120 units for the Indian Air Force and potential exports to countries in Southeast Asia and Africa, Tejas is here to stay. The HAL Tejas represents a significant step in India's defense autonomy, and its success could tip the scales in Asia's military power dynamics. While challenges remain, the future looks promising for this indigenous marvel. Could Tejas be the next big player in Asia? Only time will tell. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe for more dives into military technology and history. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.